This is Samantha Narson with Your News in 90. Here are your stories for Wednesday, October 21st. In state news, Florida officials charged several people in a flying squirrels trafficking operation. There have been at least seven people arrested in the smuggling of these squirrels. These animals are protected wildlife in Florida. As many as 3,600 of them were caught and shipped overseas. According to Florida Fish and Wildlife Commission, this illegal plot acquired hundreds of thousands of dollars. Officials say buyers would travel from South Korea to purchase the exotic pets from the dealer. Florida authorities expect more arrests. In national news, Amazon is now allowing its corporate employees to work from home until mid-2021 as the pandemic progresses. The company currently allows office workers to come into work. The extended work from home offer does not apply to its warehouse workers who have been deemed as essential. These workers have continued in-person service throughout the pandemic. Amazon says it changed the setup of its office for physical distancing, deep cleaning and the administering of temperature checks. Amazon's warehouses have become a center for household supplies during the pandemic. In interstellar news, the first space station crew to launch during a pandemic returns to Earth today. NASA astronaut Chris Cassidy and Russian cosmonauts Anatoly Ivanishin and Ivan Wagner launched to the International Space Station on April 9th. This was weeks after COVID-19 was declared a pandemic by the World Health Organization. They spent 196 days in space at the ISS. They completed more than 3,000 orbits around the Earth and traveled 83 million miles. The crew is set to land at 10.55 p.m. Eastern Time in Kazakhstan. That's your News in 90, I'm Samantha Narson, and your Florida news is always on at wuft.org.